Hey everyone, Tyler Grant here with Dynamic Training Strategies. I have my friend Grant here today to help me out with a new product for more experienced shooters to become more efficient with their time out of the range. And this, pro and this product is from Stroop. So I've had Grant get in this position that we discussed earlier. And what this does, um, it's, it's a system that, that's hooked up to his arms and his legs. And he goes up to the high compress ready and he brings the gun out to full extension. As you can see, it puts some tension as he goes out. So come back to the high press ready. In theory, what this does, it trains the most, all the muscle groups when we get out to full kinesthetic alignment. But also, go ahead and extend back out. It makes him engage muscles and he has a more tendency to roll things forward like his shoulders and get, and get his elbows blocked out. Come back. So he can utilize the bones and uh, bone structure and use that as uh, it's a little bit more stable and it's less fatiguing when we go out all the way instead of utilizing all those muscles, okay? Also, in theory, we'll become faster because we're training those muscle groups underneath the band tension. Band tension is independent of gravity, okay? Also, generally it becomes a stronger position. We have a, we'll have a stronger high compression rating. We'll also have a stronger full kinesthetic alignment because we are exercising those muscles. Go ahead and head back and go ahead and extend back all the way out, Brent. Also, what this will do, if, and uh, we'll go out in the range here a little bit and I'll be shooting with it, come back in, it will increase our muscle endurance, okay? So if we're in a critical incident and we have to shoot, we can be in that position longer, but also if we're at a training course, our fatigue will go down because we have trained those muscles and have more muscle endurance. We can have to keep that strength longer so we'll be able to learn more and not worry about fatigue. Go ahead and head back out one more time. But also, as you can see, he's utilizing all these stabilizing muscles in his hips, in his shoulders, in his knees to stay in his position. And if he keeps, out, if he keeps uh, extended out, and you'll notice here in a second, he'll start to have a slight right, shake to here. So let's take this out to the range, and I'm going to put some rounds through it, and I'm going to get my general, uh, general thoughts about the shoots. Extend. Touch. Press. Up. Okay, I just finished up shooting with the Stroops on, and I do feel this will be a double-edged sword, just like a lot of other things are out there in the, in the community, such as pro timers, certain drills that only get you good at those certain drills. I believe this, uh, this piece of gear will aid you in becoming more efficient while you're on the range if you use properly. Okay, it does, it, it does help you recruit all those little stabilizer muscles. It does help you um, to, to make sure that you are in that full kinesthetic line position if you shoot that way, which I do, and I still believe that's the best way of shooting. Because if you don't, it, you can feel the extra pressure. Um, uh, you, excuse me, you don't feel extra pressure. You just fatigue a little quicker. Okay, um, it made me really stabilize my stance and make sure I was I stopped moving and make sure I wasn't overcorrecting once I was doing incorporating a lot of movement. But when you use something like this, you have to go slower because it's putting your hand, it's putting your hands out of position of how you normally feel with proprioception, knowing where your hands and feet at, you touching your body, knowing where your body is in time and space, it kind of throws that off a little bit. So you have to be careful of that because if you try to go too fast, you can very easily just get the timing off and um, put, a, put a muzzle where it doesn't need to go. So you have to be very careful of this piece of gear. Um, maybe you don't want to use this a lot. This is something when you, uh, when you go out and actually plan your practice sessions, uh, when you front load your practice, you actually need to 
um, think about how many rounds you need to use. Honestly, I really wouldn't shoot more than 50 rounds with it at a time. And again, that's subjective. That's just um, uh, what I'm thinking because over time, you will fatigue a lot faster wearing this when just uh, shooting on the range, okay? So with this, you will fatigue quicker, but also you have to realize this is something that you do not need to wear every single time on the range. This shouldn't be something where you go out to the range, you wear this the whole time. That's just not gonna work. I'm a pretty fit, pretty athletic guy, and I could tell uh, towards the end, I wasn't necessarily getting shaky, but I was starting to get that borderline of, of muscle fatigue with this band system, okay? So again, if you have any questions, please give me an email, tyler at dynamictrainstrategies.com about this Stroop Systems. If you're interested in that or just taking a course, uh, again, just contact me. Uh, I'll have all the appropriate links down at the bottom. I just want to say stay safe. I hope you see you on the range.